Hello, welcome back to Stranded Deep and good morning. It is currently 7.15 in the game. It is raining out, heavy rain, free water. It's raining inside. Wish that would not happen, but meh, that's okay. So we do have something kind of cool planned that I wanted to do for a while. But I couldn't because I messed up my other boat. Oh yeah, also um, off camera cleaned up this area a little bit. Oop. Got those. Let me show you where I put everything. So all tools and weapons and stuff here. Go. Supposed to go there. And then all medicine supplies go here. And my bed. I need flashlights on my bed. I haven't really put anything upstairs yet, but I was thinking also building like a little sh shed out here and putting my engine parts in it. Just like a little one. One foundation. Oh, I need some water. Which is fine because it's raining out right now, so free water. I'd like to I'd like the rain to go away before I had what I wanted to do today planned out. Hoping it stops soon. Oh, well, speak of the devil. One down on food, that's okay, I don't really need it. There we go. Nice, warm, beautiful day. Okay. So plan today is, I've always wanted to see if my boat, which is faster. So what I'm going to do here, I got my cell phone ready. I am going to take each one over to that island there. I'm going to go straight as I can. I'm going to time it. And I'm going to see which is faster and which is slower. Obviously, we're going to know this guy is going to be slower. But it'd be interesting to see between these two, this one being more weighted and bigger, this one being a lot more harder to drive, apparently, which one is going to be faster getting over there. So let's get started. Um, I'm going to do this one first. I will put the times in the video. Okay, so I'm going to go right from the back of the dock here. I'm going to start my timer and go. Seventy-seven. I was really worried about hitting that barrel for a second there on the way over, but all right, not too bad. All right, now I gotta take it back. set my timer. Timer is going to be off a little bit because by the time I press it and hit the arrow to drive it's going to be a little little off. Alright, now we're going to do this one. Feeling this is gonna be a little bit harder. Make sure I'm right at the dock. When you're gonna wind up, that's the tricky part. Alright, look. Let's go.
2096. So not much difference, but a little bit. Definitely a lot harder to handle, that's for sure. And especially that part there. Definitely a lot harder to handle with the with it not being so big. I could have used. I, I know I could have done it with the editing and just like timed it there. Um, watch it and edit it, but I figured out and just do it with my phone. That way I can write them down and whatnot. Okay, now. I don't know why I need to face with this one. Oh, so that's going backwards. All right, so we're lined up and let's go. Definitely going to be the slower of the three, I believe. All right, so we got. That was twenty nine thirty eight. Now, if you time it yourself while you're watching the videos, I'm sure no one's gonna do. But my time a little bit, like I said, I do have to put my cell phone and then down and stop it, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So it's not that accurate we know the raft's gonna be the the um, sales gonna be slower definitely seems slower going back that is for sure on this side all right so I'm gonna show the totals we had the big boat 21 the little boat 20 and then the sailboat about 29 ish so yeah, I was somewhat right the little boat is a little bit faster but not by much not by much it's, it's a lot harder, as you can see, to handle and to drive around, so yeah, that's kind of cool. I've been wanting to do that for a while, and now we have. All right, so now I'm thinking, let's get my hammer here. So I just want to put something, I don't want to attach it. Oh, there we go. I guess I can't, oh, there we go. There, perfect. All right, let's put some stairs to it just so it's easy access. So this is going to be the start of our, let's get rid of this hammer here. Got a compass out. Just 
just collected so many parts. Alright, 50 days survived. Build some walls around. Little storage shed for engine parts. Looking pretty good. Cleaned up this area a lot. Could do something kind of bigger for storing these items, but I think that might be a little too big. A little too unrealistic. Wish I can do away with this damn thing. Wish I could break it up apart and get my engine parts back, but that's okay. Alright, so it's going to be a little bit shorter of a video today. Um, uh, thumbs up for the boat races and see what's faster, what's not. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. And feel free to share. And I'm going swimming. We will see you later.